Hi, this is Roger. Thanks for dropping by. Pile of bricks. They had to come out of the car and be carried round three at a time because they're concrete now. In heavy. Um, anyway, for, that was first job of the day and this is what I've been up to. Getting my first lot of bonsai staging done. If you want to see me making this, including some speeded up bits, Benny Hill time, yay! <laughs> you know, along with some music. That's over on the Bonsai channel. Um, actually, I'll put an info card up for those that want to go and see it, save you sort of mucking about with different channels. And if you get over there and you find that you're watching my Bonsai channel and you're not actually subscribed, it would be awfully nice, awfully nice if you did so, because I'm really struggling to get that channel to climb. And also do the old thumbs up. And then, in theory, if you've been over there and watched it, you drop back here. So the info card's coming up now. Right, if you've been away, thank you for popping across there and putting a view onto that video. That's really nice of you. And the fact that I've been doing all that means I'm, I'm not going to do anything elaborate as far as the uh, orchid world is concerned today. I had a phone call from my sister on Monday and reminding me that we've got a funeral to go to tomorrow. So thanks for the short notice. So that's messed my week up because it's cut it in half. Now it's a very distant relative. It's a, I think it's the son of my grand's sister. And my grand died about 40 years ago. Um, <laughs> um, anyway, this, this guy's been around the family as long as I can remember, but in very small quantities. Like he, he, he turned up at my mum's 90th birthday, for instance. Um, he just pops up every now and again, so he's like a long-term but distant friend of the family. And my sister said, we ought to go to represent mum, who's no longer with us. So, <laughs> I don't like, I've had enough of funerals lately, really have. Anyway, I said I'd turn up because I felt like I ought to. So that's um, Wednesday, which is tomorrow, isn't it? Oh, I've forgotten. Yeah, tomorrow. Um, so that knocks out most of tomorrow. The service is at 11. And then it's off to the cemetery, which is like the other, e the other end of a big town. So you've got to, go and f you've got to park, find then go and find your car again to go to the next bit. And then back past where you were before and on a bit more to for where the afters thing is. So it's a right faff. And I think I'm going to miss out the cemetery bit. I'll go to the service because that's, you know, that's sort of um, showing your respect bit. And then I shall head off in the direction of where the other bit is and wait for people to turn up. <laughs> it's a hotel, actually. I could go and sit and have a coffee and a cake, couldn't I, in the lounge. It overlooks the sea as well. So uh, perhaps I'll or walk along the coast. I'll do something. But I, I don't fancy going to the cemetery bit. So that's tomorrow, that's going to take up most of my day. I'm hoping to be able to get another coat on this before I go. <sighs> this needs two coats and it's two sides. Obviously you can't do the front and the back at the same time because one side will be wet, won't it? So I have to do one side and then it needs between two and four hours to be touch dry to turn it over and, and do the other side. And I need to put another coat on both sides. Um, I'd like to have done that tomorrow because it's in the way now, you know. Anyway, I might get it done, I might not. If I got up and did that first thing and then it could possibly be dry when I get back and I'm going to really feel like doing that after a funeral. Anyway, that's what I've been up to today and I need to crack on with, with work, with things to do, to do with tidying up the garden, and part of that is to get the bonsai off the chairs and the tables onto some proper staging. So it's all tied in together. Anyway, I keep saying that the Shari baby's got nice flowers on it and not actually showing you. So this is my version of Shari baby. There are many um, types of Shari baby you know, with a, with a name in quotes afterwards. Um, and they vary quite a bit. Um, some are a lot more pink. Um, some have got more edging to them. Um, but that's my version. That's a nice spike. Um, nice branches on it. Most of the buds are open now. It's got another nice spike coming alongside. And another one lurking down there, heading up to the sky through all the leaves. So it's a nice 
good strong plant that one, it's, um, it's doing well. It's filled the pot, massive bulbs. Anyway, that's that one. And the other thing I wanted to show you is um, it's a bit of Mazda Valia time at the moment. We've got the, the giant one over here has pushed a bloom out and that pushed a bloom out from halfway up the spike that I cut off. So obviously we're not supposed to cut the spikes off on this one. And that is a cross, I think it's Cuculata crossed with Hercules. Um, and it's doing a mass of new growth down the bottom there, pushing on nicely. So that's a nice happy plant. Um, and then we've got this one. Um, this bloom's been open a little while. This is the second one coming, so that's good. And then over here, we've got another one. Um, this is the one I got at the auction off of Allen. Um, so I haven't seen these blooms before but we've got one anyway, so we've got a few Mazda Valleys out. Now, over this side of the grow room, there's nothing. There's not one Restrepia bloom on all my plants, nothing. All these over here have got no spikes or buds or anything. Um, yes, very, very, very green over this side. <laughs> uh, and quite honestly, there's not a huge amount coming over here. We've got our Shelob Tolkien spikes coming on here. There's four of those. And we've got our radiata spikes coming on here. Um, and we've got our little display on the table, but it's not a huge amount about at the moment. Now, traditionally we do everything in bloom on the 8th. I will probably give it a miss this month for two reasons. One, that's it, you've, pr you've just seen really what's in bloom. And in addition to that, it's, on, it's Saturday the 8th and I've got a, a Orchid Society meeting on Saturday, so that takes priority obviously because I won't be in for most of the day so uh, we'll give that a miss um, but we will do the project orchids on Friday uh, orchid number six I think it is so we'll do that and uh, I, I doubt if I'll get anything filmed tomorrow because of this drastic funeral that I got to go to so we'll be back up and running again some something along the lines on Thursday I'll hopefully get some repots done or something or sort out a few mounts get back and do something proper orchid like <laughs> anyway that's it for today as I said I've been busy um, done all this <laughs> using a load of tools I hadn't used before and um, uh, <laughs> there's some speeded up sections but, uh, also in, within those speeded up sections obviously I cut the soundtrack off because there were some bleeps <laughs> definitely some bleeps and it was all to do with trying to use tools that I've never used before <laughs> trying to work out which way up they go and all that anyway that's what I've been up to and uh, I'll see you probably on Thursday and um, thanks for dropping by and if you did go across and have a look at the, um, the, the bonsai channel thanks for that and if you subscribed real thanks for that so uh, and I'll see you next time thanks for dropping by <laughs>